ahead. Hi, my name is Ronnie. This is Gabriel. Together, he and I are a big part of VIP, Veterinary Inclusive Prosthetics. We jump on our truck at the slightest call of, of assistance, and we drive all the way across the country to go help other animals in need. He's my constant companion going on the road. Go. Hi, I'm Ronnie Graves. This is our motor coach that we drive across the country in to help animals. We get a call in Bushnell, Florida and asked to come up to New York or Colorado, California, wherever it needs to be. And we jump in this vehicle with our supplies and we go run and help. This, 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 is, how, this is how we travel. They, uh, I'm being asked to produce a, a high energy film and I don't know how. Hi, I'm Ronnie from VIP, and we've been asked to respond to help an animal in need. Our trusty casting supplies, and we're on our way. Hi, we're going to get ready and go inside the pasture and go find a three-legged jackass. Hi, well we found our three-legged little jackass. He's out here in the pasture munching grass. Now we're going to take the prosthesis that we've made for him and put it on him. Luigi is a congenital birth defect. He was born without his lower left leg below the knee. He has a small portion of hoof section on it. He's now 11 years old. He's been wearing a, a prosthesis for about the last 10 years or so. The woman who originally raised him tried to fit him with a PVC pipe. That just doesn't work. One of the features about a leg is that it needs to fit very closely and that's what we're going to do today is fit this new prosthesis onto Luigi. This is a flexible inner socket. This is his rigid outer socket that will give him the support that he needs. Lower left leg is missing from below the knee. He should be up in this height range as a normal stance but he's not. He does have a hoof section down here, but as you can see, his leg rotates in instead of forward and backward. We can't allow him to do that. It would His prosthesis would hit his other side if we had a bending knee joint there. So instead, we've made him a peg leg. Huh. All right, we're sitting down in front of Luigi right now, and we're going to put first his flexible inner socket on. We spread the front of it open and start putting his leg inside. Now he's like a child with a shoe. He tries to curl his toes up and make it difficult to get into place. Eventually it will settle down. There he goes. And now the socket is fitting properly. We can support it from the bottom or the sides. Now we take the rigid shell of his prosthesis and we're going to put it on. We start at the bottom, slide his knee joint inside, and then push the socket into place.
These do not have to be pulled super tight. They're just snugged up to hold him into place and give him the support that he needs to walk around the pasture or to run and play as he's been known to do. That's my buddy. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> what are you doing, Luigi? Luigi, we'll see you later when we have the next checkup, okay? See ya.